I, uh, I, I brought some of his, uh, his chicken snack with him if you want to give him some. I don't know, like, if you're allowed to after you trim him, but... Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, he's, uh, he's had a hard week. We had an exterminator a week ago tomorrow, and the exterminator is doing a second spray next week. Oh, wow. So, he's going to be very upset with me, because he's the only one of my three who's getting in a carrier oh. one, <laughs> one, like, th three times in as many weeks, yeah. and so... He is, he's, he's going to be very upset with me, but as long as there's chicken snack. There you go. <laughs> as long as he's got his chicken. Right, love? This is Nigel, right? Yep, okay. yep. My Nigel bud. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, it's sweet. Yep. <laughs> yeah, I remember you, you called him <laughs> my, my illegal panther last time. <laughs> yes. He's so, he's so big. Beautiful. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Sometimes people underestimate how big he is. Just yeah. seeing pictures mm -hmm. on Instagram, then they come over and they're just like, oh my god, that cat is huge. I'm like, yeah, I told you this cat is huge. <laughs> his, his carrier is recommended for like a small Jack Russell or, you know, or, or a, uh, I guess like, I think Cocker Spaniels, I've seen them in two sizes, like, you know, 35 to 40 pounds and yeah. then um, 25 to 35, thereabouts, like, you know, it's like a miniature Cocker or small jack rustle or something, you know, that, that's what this carrier's sized for, but no, it's like, oh yeah, like, uh, I was, when I was putting them in the, oh god, because I couldn't afford to, uh, to board them for the day last week, they came out busking with me, and so Murnau has the, uh, has the little, uh, space bubble backpack carrier, Aww. and, uh, Phoebe's, Phoebe's carrier is half this size, and she fits in it, Angel Bud, hey sweet Phoebe, hi, yeah, Nigel got back maybe 20 minutes ago. Uh, we stopped for ice cream for, well, for myself, but I had, uh, I had his, uh, his chicken snack for him. This is another one. Uh, so yeah, this is, oh wait, no, that's something else. Where's the one that he finished? Oh, it's right here. So here's the one that he finished at, uh, well, he had part of it. Oh, there's still some left. So he had part of his chicken snack at, uh, at the Cold Stone by Petco, and I also, um, before we left Petco, I, uh, eh. before we left Petco, I, uh, I stopped and I got him a grass and a catnip. They were both in a little bit sorry condition, so they were 35% off, but I know from experience, catnip will come back so fast, and honestly, so does cat grass. Uh, uh, to do that. <laughs> oh, he's, he's very happy to have this. Nigel's gotten to a point where every time I bring him back from being out in the carrier for whatever reason, he, he gets really demanding of chicken snack when we come home. So he, I, uh, I took off my, uh, I took off my bags and my jacket and let him out of the carrier and he comes right over to the chair because he knew chicken snack was coming or at least like the rest of this one any, well, no, the rest of the, the rest of the chicken snack. The chicken snack that he didn't finish at, uh, at ice cream, he, uh, you know, it was like maybe two thirds left over so I broke that all up for him and I gave him his grass and his catnip and as long as I keep the catnip um, watered and yeah, maybe a little bit of a fertilizer <laughs> spike. Uh, that'll come right back, and so will the grass. And he's he's very happy with me now. Right, love, lover boy, my lover boy named Nigel, but Nigel. Okay, ignore me, love. Oh, here comes Phoebe. Phoebe, Phoebe, Phoebe. Hey, Missy Phoebe. Yes. Yeah, I know. There's a mess on the floor. Whatever. It's going to be picked up before the exterminator comes back. All right. And there was Nigel's big day. Got his nails clipped. And I don't have claw caps right now for him. Plus, that would be an extra $10 to apply. Uh, I don't know why. Because I, I bring my own caps and glue uh, for the claw caps. So I don't know why it's extra to apply them, but, or at least $10 extra. Like, I can see five. I can see $5 extra to apply. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I'm sure they've got their reasons, but, um, yeah. So he got his nails clipped, and then he got some chicken snack while I went and had some Cold Stone, because I deserve some. 
and uh, the uh, I had the Irish cream with raspberries. That's really good, um, and a small one. I I never have more than a small one, honestly. Even before I started actively um, dieting with some portion control, that's all it is with me right now is portion control since January. Dropped twenty five pounds though, almost two stone. Ah, so, yeah, and now he gets his grass after he decimated that catnip. <laughs> oh, he knows he's the one getting the treat after after all of that adventure today. Because he's my boy. He's my sweet boy. My sweet boy named Nigel Bud. Nigel. Nigel. I love you. I love you, Nigel. Oh, he's busy with his grass. He'll snuzzle all over me later. <laughs> Silly. Silly cat. Oh, I'm gonna go fill his treat ball. Ha <laughs> ha. Let's, let's see him play with the treat ball after I fill it. I'd almost forgotten about the other treat toy. Uh-oh. Hey, Murnau. Hi. Yes. All attention on Murnau. Okay, he's... Okay, he went up the cat tree now. And we hear him on the scratching post. Oh, okay, he is moving them around. Okay. Uh-oh. Is there somebody with a tiny penis on their car? Tiny penis revs the engine. Oh, yes, it does. Tiny penis revving engine. Oh, yeah. Tiny penis revs the engine. Why is this unfocused? Nigel. Oh, all right. Is the light in your way? Nigel, but... Fine, go into the kitchen. Do that, cat.